Okay, create lookup filters. So let's do this together. Before that, I'm going to launch my TP launch and I'm going to close that. So create a lookup relationship. This should be pretty straightforward. I'm going to drag this onto my other screen. That. So let's go to setup. So the first one, we want to create a lookup relationship from a case object. And then we want to go look it up to the user object. So object manager, and then you can search for case, case there, field and relationship, new lookup object so lookup filter that would be lookup relationship here and then next related to the user object user object and next the name is backup agent so backup agent and I'm going to copy the description and the help text from the trailhead and uh, help text there. Okay, so now we want to show filter settings and we want to filter this up. So the user profile name equals support user user profile name user profile here the name equals support user or you can look up from here support user okay so the filter type is it doesn't say in the trailhead playground so we're going to leave everything um, as it is. And next, we are going to make everybody read only. So all the other users can only read that, but the support user can modify it. All right, next. Add them to the page layout and save. Okay, so Next, add a filter for uh, to the case contact name so that the user can only select contacts related to the account selected in account name. All right, so I'm gonna uh, find contact name here. So contact name, so we are still in the case object, contact name. And then um, I'm going to edit this. Now we are going to define the lookup filter. So basically contact name account ID. So I'm going to show filter settings. Contact name. Here account ID equals case account ID. Okay equals field case account ID well value probably or field case account ID so the contact name that can be chosen for a particular case can only be a contact that is under the same account for that case that makes sense right okay and that's pretty much it so I'm gonna hit save there and that's pretty much it so that's all I'm gonna drag my trailhead over here again snap it back and let's verify the step make sure we get everything right bada bing bada boom Hit that subscribe button 
and explore new trailhead grounds and learn to implement the most useful and popular apps on the Salesforce App Exchange. And do yourself a favor, like this video and you'll be surprised on how much more you understand when watching this same video after liking it. Don't take my word, watch this one more time after you like the video and see it for yourself. Bada bing, bada boom.